Hold on, everybody. Uh, we are here to play <clears throat> a game off of... Let me see what website that was real quick. Yeah, it's a, it's a website where you can go and download... Um, let me see here. Where is it? Top games. Okay, so this is... Uh, itch itch.io uh apparently everybody here will have <clears throat> uh pretty much brand new people that are, that that create new content of video games for gamers to play they usually stick it right here um this is before it gets big you know for between steam and all them and i just happened to come across one called i'm home and that's the one that i'm going to play Wow, that's really missized, isn't it? Holy crap. I'm just trying to get it back on my other screen here. My apologize. <clears throat> Alright. And I know I got some funky headphones, but I like these the best because they're in ear and they actually uh, do really well. But uh, yeah, if you guys ever want to. Um, literally uh play this game uh all you have to do is just go to the link that i put in the description below and you'll be able to <clears throat> uh download it yourself or browse other games um from itch i guess that's i'm just gonna call it itch because that i didn't even know it was called itch when i uh came across it but this is where like if uh, if you guys are used to seeing markiplier it's where he mostly got his name from on da downloading those games and just playing them uh i'm going to go ahead and open this and see what we got run anyways there we go it won't play what code execution cannot be what what how dare you? I don't get it. <laughs> um, <clears throat> maybe you have to play it from here, I guess. Uh, of course I do. Wow. Okay. That's special. I never seen that before. Uh, we're going to go with just high. Um, Which one is, yeah, hopefully this is going to be on this display here, but <clears throat> yeah, I've never seen where you have to have the file here in this section. Like I had it on my desktop, so that way I wouldn't have to do this crap, but whatever. Um, first time for everything, I guess. All right, input. Da, 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 da. I didn't know you could shoot in this game. This says fire one all the way to three. All right, let's play it. Fuck it. Dum 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 A game by M23 Bob Games. Alright, you can trust anybody with the name Bob. No settings or additional settings to control volume, it looks like. I don't know if you guys can hear it or not. But let me know in the comments. But here we go. I'm home. Chapter one. So chapter two, three, four, and five are coming soon. Uh, you wake up and you. Oh shit! I, I didn't even read what I said. I'm home awake, honey. See anybody there? No. Nobody there. Oh, it's Zoom. Oh, is that what the outside world looks like? Daytime, sunshine, trees that look all alike. And it looks like some trees that are floating in the sky as well. Hmm, that is so sweet. And let's see, new message. Message from Carly. Don't forget to shut all of the lights off uh, in the house before you leave for work. Okay, just uh, go to work then. Hey, I got a cell phone too. That's awesome. Did that? Uh, uh, 
Did I open that? Oh, I guess I did. Oh, I just have to take a crap. Oh, yeah. Take a crap in the crapper. Uh, I don't know how to interact with any of this. Theater. I don't have a flashlight. I have a flush light. <laughs> it flushes down the toilet. And uh, nothing over here. Nothing to interact with. And again, the bright sun shine outside with all the trees that look alike. All right, let's go to the next room. Okay, so we got to shut the lights off. So how do you... You're supposed to interact with it, right? And I can't. Nope. Well, I, I don't know how I'm supposed to shut the lights off if I can't interact with everything. Or maybe I'm not supposed to. Okay. Uh. Okay, well, apparently I can't turn off the bathroom light. Let me see. Let me go back in there real quick. Open up. I got a bad feeling about this. If I'm supposed to shut off all the lights and the bathroom won't shut off, might be some problems. Okay, open up. Stop it. You know, probably a good thing to have on this if the developer's watching, because he apparently does go watch uh, you know videos of his game. If by some mere chance you can put it interactive, uh, let's just say I can open it up with the E button, because that's kind of, yeah, that's kind of eerie to, to handle there. New message! Uh, message from Carly. Don't forget to shut off all the lights of the house before you leave for work. Okay, I already read that. Why are you telling me again? Did I shut the lowest lights off? I could have sworn I just shut that light off. Oh, it just looks like it's still on. Okay. Alright, um, nothing in here but some boxes. Hey, what are you doing? Am I moving? Can I pick that up? It looks like it just... It just looks like a Minecraft box. It doesn't look like an actual box box. Hmm. Well, that's just strange, and I don't know. But I'm gonna turn this light off. Because the game told me so. Okay, so I can't turn that light off either. Uh -huh. And again with the door mechanics. Stop it. <clears throat> All right. Uh, here we are in a different part of the room. Uh-huh, yes, I know, message. All right, the moving company said that, that they would have our kitchen stuff delivered within three days. Uh, and it kind of looks like a uh, developer still watching. The, the words kind of cut off there on that part, but I guess it looks like the list should be on the table in the living room. Just kind of point that out. Uh, it's nothing serious, but... There are critics out there. No, I am not one of them. Push E to go. No, no. I want to explore the rest of the house. I want to go down the way that I haven't gone. Hey, here's the living room with a bunch of boxes everywhere. Or is that something else? So I got to turn off all these lights that apparently won't shut off. I think that's probably the hint hint of the game is uh oh look the outside again oh it's so amazing but i think that's part of the mechanic of the game uh <clears throat> it's telling you to turn off the lights you can turn off only some lights but not all of them so i'm gonna try again turn off turn off nope i don't know what the point of the game is uh if anybody's uh wondering there was no description of the game and this is a big house and a big dining room holy crap <clears throat> uh the moving company uh, yeah 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 i heard you the first time i don't Ooh. oh wow my closet is huge that's a lot of shoes that's what that reminds me of. i can put shoes in there Ooh. but yeah there's no description on the game um so you're kind of going in pretty much uh pretty much ass first i mean you don't know what to expect 
So I didn't bother reading anybody's uh, comments on the game. Open up, thank you. And I don't want to spoil it for myself, so I in turn. What? <gasps> now I can turn the lights off. Oh, is it only when I leave? I can turn. There's no lights in here. No shit. See, uh, that's why I'm asking. To see if there's a way to probably make that a mechanic where you hit E to open and close doors, because that that doesn't make it easy. So I'm gonna try shutting off this light in here. Maybe there's a certain. Oh, there is a certain order. Okay. Or maybe it's just when I leave. Um. Uh, I guess I didn't do exactly what I was supposed to do in here, maybe? Uh, hello! Throw it. Nope. Didn't work. Well, that one won't shut off. Well, uh... Ah, come on! Alright, is there a light in here? There is a light in here. Can I turn that off? No? No light switch? I don't see a light switch and how I'm supposed to turn that one out of all of them off. I'm not sure. I can't... Can you get out of my way, please? Nope, I can't move the chair. I don't know how to turn that off. There's no button. There's no power cord. I can't see anything. Like oh, come on. Get out of my way, thank you. Alright. There we go, now I can turn that off. Now it looks like all the lights are off, officially. <clears throat> I'm double checking the restroom, just to be safe. Oh, how convenient that it's not. There we go, now all the lights are officially off. Sweet, now I can run, I'm gonna go... I'm gonna go to work, ladies and gentlemen. Duh. Oh. Put all the boxes in the storage room, put all the mail uh, on the desks and the shelves. That is some obvious mail. Okay. That's hopefully on the shelf. <laughs> it's pretty uh, glitchy. All right, Jack. Hey, Peter. I just wanted to tell you that uh, boss wants you to put all the mail in the shelves and all the boxes on the storage mail room. I well, I'm. <clears throat> yeah, these are shelves, right? Okay, Carly, honey, I'm not coming back home ever again. Something is not right about our house. I'm staying in town hotel. I would just immediately leave work to go see what the hell is going up her bum. But, all right. So, here we are. All right. Mail. Box. No, it fell. Son of a bitch. All right, come here. Alright, so I am going to put you on the shelf. There we go. I don't think you're gonna be considered a shelf if you're just floating in the air. And you know, I'll just put you somewhere else. How about that? How about right here? There you go. You fell straight. I don't know if the floor counts, but it's still a shelf, so whatever. So that's my job is to put Mel on the shelves and then and then just apparently falls right through. Okay. That's great. And I only have one spot to put it. I uh, can't grab that again. Oh, it fell through. Okay, so this is considered a box, right? How come I can't grab that? <clears throat> okay, uh, Mel, thank you box Nolta Nolta dying okay mail mm, shelf mm, shelf okay whatever it's there I don't care shoot and maybe it's supposed to float like that I don't know 
Alright, uh... Mail on the desk in the shelves, uh, put the st put boxes in the storage room. So... Nope, I don't want to go home yet. So storage, storage room is right here, I'm assuming. Ah, oh, yes it is, okay. Oh, oh, come on, come on, open up for me. There we go. Hey, this is pretty easy. So far, so good. All right. <clears throat> Who would have known work would be this this smooth and this easy? I mean, eh, get up, get up, get up. Okay. I only got a quick second before that door automatically closes. I mean, I kind of like it in this you know, form factor of it being automatic because then I, would, I wouldn't have to worry about pushing the button, putting it down, or putting it down, pushing the button, and then, you know, getting it back up. Oh, that was awesome. And at least this way uh, is done for you, but at least at the house, uh, be a good mechanic to kind of, you know, make sure you're able to push E and all that fun jazz. Open up. There we go. Alright. Might as well just get all the boxes because the mail... I guess I already got all the boxes. I would say the mail is, is kind of more of the prick here. Okay. Alright, putting you in there as you fall through through there. Okay. Uh huh. Okay. I don't know if this counts, but uh, I'm kind of hoping it does. Uh, there. Yep. Pretty much perfect. All right. Man, I could do this for a living. Just putting mail in a shelf. Oh. Uh. Don't don't you fall. Oops. All right. So we're 17. We're about 17 minutes into the stream. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. We're gonna play now. Um, put you there. And then, oh no no grab you. Thank you. <clears throat> put you there. Put you there, and I have to get home to the honey. Yeah, yeah. Cause what she say? Something is not right about the house. Of course, at this point. No! Oh no, I lost the freaking mail. Crap. Okay. Hopefully that won't... Hopefully that won't um, affect the game in any way. Uh, and the mail is just not going on the shelves, so hopefully that doesn't affect my gameplay either. I don't think floating in the air is considered being in the mailbox. <clears throat> Unless that's what the car, you know, whatever her name is, is saying that is uh, strange about our house. Could be st strange around here. That almost fell. Okay. Putting some mail. Jack, Jack, you got some mail, Jack. I bet that saved a lot of time just to write mail on mail instead of going into hardcore detail. I understand that that may have a lot of... A lot of uh, <clears throat> extra time you have to put into making that type of detail into a game. And here we are. Okay, so I can't put too much. Okay, I don't know if the floor counts, but whatever. So hopefully, the game developer. <clears throat> and... Doo -doo. Okay, so that's all of them. Some of them are floating. Well, I'm okay with that. Um, and some of them are not. All right, so okay, so what we're gonna try to do is see if they will allow me to go home now. Uh, hope so. I mean, unless I forgot um a box. And it wouldn't let me pick up that box. Yep, 
Yeah, it won't let me pick up that box. Okay, so we're done. We are done. I like how my, uh, I want to assume this is my desk and it's the only one that doesn't have a chair. Who needs a chair? Chapter one complete. That was the end of it. That was the whole thing. I you is it what? We didn't get into any greedy stuff. Gritty, not greedy, gritty. We need the grits, man. Chapter one, chapter one and chapter two, I would assume is a little bit more going to the grits of the game. Okay. Well, I liked it. It was good. I mean, graphics, I'm not worried about graphics, to be honest. It can look like complete 2012 or 2002 graphics, and I wouldn't even be bothered by it. But as long as it's not like 1990 graphics, uh, yeah. <clears throat> that overall good game a uh, little bit on the polishing of different stuff but other than that um the only glitch i came across was uh the mail falling through the thing and i forgot what the other part was when i first started the stream but hey pretty good not too shabby all right so i guess we're done with that game so Oh, that's all she wrote. All right. Well, uh I I guess I can play a different game. Uh let me see what I have real quick. Uh da da da, da. uh bum bum bum. Hello neighbor, the Alpha 3 version. Hmm. Let's see, Stanley. You know what? Might be a good idea just to kind <clears> of. <throat> How about this? How about we just look at the website to see what games they have? Um, I like to look at. I mean, you can look at um, whatever's popular on the game, but if you're a creator, yeah, it's better just to look at you know what is most recent. So that way you can see what's new and and potentially unique to you streaming it on your channel. But let's take a look. We got start survey. Um, I didn't have any screenshots of that, so I didn't know how good that was. But it looked pretty decent. Uh, well, the thumbnail looks pretty good, I would say. Sonic the Nightmare. I'm a little, little strange about that one. I mean, didn't really look like... I mean, it's the Nightmare version. I don't know what that really entails, so let's click on it. kind of brings up attention. Okay. What is Nightmare? Oh, a Nightmare Tales. Okay. <laughs> That's pretty cool. But there's no information regarding it, and no one's probably played it. See? No comments or nothing. No no tag. You're it. Okay, so we're going to go back. So it's, it's fresh. It's brand new. I think, uh, let's see, how, how do you tell if it's really brand new? I mean, the only thing I knew is I clicked on most recent. Usually it tells you when it's posted, but I guess this one doesn't. Okay. Um, liberate Hong Kong. Okay. Now, what caught my attention was the doll. Uh, bad night, the falling bomb. Uh, Z X C V. Okay. Uh. Dark Reflection, interesting name. And this one kind of reminded me of like uh, War at Worlds, Worlds at War, something like whatever that movie was. Um, not the Tom Cruise. Well, I mean, it is Tom Cruise, but there's an older version. Just kind of like a giant tripod looking everywhere and looks like you're just running away and surviving. Uh, but now this one here did catch my eye. This one was uh, <clears throat> uh, the Silent Hill for The Room. Uh, I do kind of want to play that. That's actually kind of interesting. I don't know how far along developed it is. And no one else has played it. So if you're a creator, if I decide to buy it, I'll be the first one. Or you could be one of the two. Pretty interesting, I would think. Okay. Okay. Moving on. 
We're going back down. See, dark days ahead. Okay, this is the one I bought right here. Not bought, but I, I got. Um, and it's free. Cause you, you definitely can donate if you want to. Uh, I, I recommend to donate a lot. I didn't donate. Um, I just wanted to play the game real quick to see how good it is. And it looks like it has a couple more chapters uh, the developer's working on. So definitely show them some love. They do this, you know, people that, that start on a website like this, I think there's probably a thousands of them out there or whatever, but this specific one here, you know, these developers work just like regular people do. Um, regular jobs, not they're developing a game job, I mean, unless that is something they do and they just do it as on side. But they don't make money off their game, hard, hardly, half the time. So donating to them uh, encourages them to finish the game. So something that you come across you like, but they built, but it's not quite finished or it has a couple of glitches in it. You know, they, they're not angry if you tell them, hey, this is crap. This thing did this or whatever. You know, you just show them what happened. Uh, if you want to record it, if you have the capabilities or describe what happened in what location. And then they'll, they'll look into getting it fixed, seeing if they can recreate it. It takes time. It's a game. Let's see you make it. <laughs> But um, it it just takes a lot of time. Hatman, okay. Hatman looks pretty creepy. Okay. Uh, let's see. Sonic the Hedgehog, round three, the final game. Play for scary teacher. Black River. Ooh. 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 Oh. Uh huh. Yeah, I'm liking what I see so far. And they use the uh, Unity engine to make it. That's pretty good. <clears throat> uh. Games to play, games to play. And it looks like a couple of YouTubers have uh, gone out of their way to play it. Gave some feedback. This helps, like then this helps a developer to polish their game. All right, all right. Ooh. And quite a few people played it, even though this was, um, let's see, does it tell me up here when they released it? Probably not. It looks pretty interesting so far. Huh? I wish there was a wish list, or if there is, I don't know where it's at. Oh, come on. It brought me all the way back up here. <clears throat> so, Black River definitely looks pretty interesting. Uh, play for a scary teacher forest. Uh, I, I would just assume that that's like a camp counselor that's just gone nuts for whatever reason. Two horror games. Okay, so two for the price of one. All right, so this one's going to be the house, and I'm always watching you to the house. Huh? Strange. And I'm pretty sure that most of these games are going to be, um, I mean, all these games are not all going to be horror games. They're, they're going to have some different games. You just got to go to the link I put in the description and hunt it down look for games yourself <clears throat> i think they got different options up here at the top yeah like genre action blah blah blah, blah, blah all the way through why i why it shows just horror games for me is just because that that's pretty much what what makes it easy for a lot of uh developers out there to get their name out there they make unique horror games uh to scare the pants off you gets popular blows up and eventually steam gets involved or other companies like it to where it gets it out there even further recommendations etc they're not making money you're not making money kind of thing all right <laughs> jim hints <laughs> and they got cram it uh hey spc or scp i remember that okay i wonder uh, i think this is where spc actually originally um posted their game at if i remember correctly i don't know if it's this specific website but they started out just like how every other developer here started out and then they made it to steam 
Um, oh, and um, Amnesia. Amnesia did the same thing, if anybody's familiar with Amnesia. They did the same thing. Ben, uh, Blendy, okay. I thought it was like, Bendy? Doesn't look like Bendy to me. Where's the ink machine? Blendy 2, Doll Factory Alpha. Okay, so this developer, this uh, CDA Games, decided to make one and then a two. <clears throat> I think I got a lot of games I'm going to download here soon. That is interesting. That is interesting to me. The Shimmer. <laughs> is it a Teletubby? What is going on here? Okay. Project Arc, and with a C, not a K. Um, glass, the train tear. All right. Huh. Weird. I'm not seeing anything else. I'm very, I'm about to go to a different genre to see what they have. I mean, I didn't click on horror only, so it's going to show a mixture of everything. Now, this is all the stuff that's that's just got uploaded in onward. So this one could have gotten uploaded like a couple of days ago, for all we know. So I'm going to select top rated, new and popular. Popular. Let's go with popular. Let's see what they got cracking with popular. Okay, uh, Big Face Marsh, uh, Police Force, alright, The Final Silence, uh, I'm assuming that's something to do with uh, Silent Hill, so yeah, Black River was pretty popular, okay, I don't know how that one became so popular and it was just released not too long ago for recent, um, most recent <clears throat> uploads, uh, everybody's familiar with PT or, or You've come across a video that looked just like PT. It's just you just go around and around and, and weird shit keeps happening. And then sooner or later, a woman just scares the shit out of you out of nowhere. Hey, I am home. Okay, so that that did work out. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm kind of messed up my stream here on, on doing the game. And then all of a sudden this, hey, Silent Hill remake concept. Oh, that's interesting. See, I Am Home is a survival game, but I wasn't surviving. I didn't have a way to survive, so that really threw me off. Escape the Awa... Awiwaki? Awawaki? Yuriwaki? I don't know. It's it's there. All right, let's see. And, hey... There's one like, yay. Thank you guys for the liking it. I got one person watching and one like. All right, and Paula Miracum. I wonder if there, if anybody's ever made a game um, that has like Darkiplier in it for Markiplier. I think I would play that. Uh, Slender, Lonely Home. Oh, that one actually looks pretty decently well made. Nice. I'm, I'm so far. I'm impressed. Okay. All right. Uh, can I get out of that? Yeah, that looks pretty interesting. Mm. <clears throat> yeah, that's what I hate about the jewel. You actually have to pump it. I and mean, if anybody didn't know about that, yeah, you have to pump this stupid thing where the bubbles come up. It gets it circulated in the core or the coils. 
if you don't do that, you're pretty much burning the cotton that's in there or whatever it is. <clears throat> I got other vapes I use and stuff like that. And no, I'm not going to stop. All right, Mr. Hops Playhouse. Mr. Hops. Oh, okay. Okay. That's a 2D game. <clears throat> That looks interesting too. Ooh, what what is this? Oh, ooh. I like the moving pictures. I like the moving pictures. I like the moving pictures. All right. So, Poopax Gaming, how you doing? I am new. Well, welcome. Welcome to the channel. I'm just going through all the uh, channels off of itchy.com. I just played uh, I'm Home uh, a few moments ago. It was pretty short, but it has chapters one through five. And I was like, huh, what else am I going to play? My, my title says I'm home and I'm playing it, but I'm not because I finished it and it took 17 minutes. <laughs> So I'm just going through all the listing here. Um, you guys can look through the link. So if you are gaming and want to attack something brand new uh, that no one else has, uh, this will be a good website to go to. Uh, again, links in the description uh, where you can go. It's called itchy.io. If you're not familiar with that, you can go to most recent right here. And then there you go. Find a game that's brand new that no one's played and then be the first one to have a review on it. That's what gets traction to your channel people looking up games like uh start survey i i i would be familiar i would definitely wouldn't mind seeing what that's about uh it doesn't have any screenshots or anything like that but it, it, if it's anything like the the survey that's on the steam i think that might be pretty much good play to play um but yeah uh, other than that let's see one person watching okay so i don't know if you're still watching or not but still <clears throat> Um, let's see, I can, I can just drag this over here. Yay, I did something. Damn it. There we go. There, I can see comments and anybody that pops in here and there, whatever. Um, I'm, uh, ooh. It lies. There's a lot of interesting games here. Like I said, I'm about to go to um, another one, another genre, to see if they have a you know a little bit more than just. Uh, I'm still here. Why does that look familiar? Of course, only one screenshot. Ah. Oh. Is that a DeLorean? That looks like a DeLorean. <laughs> Back to the future. When the devil calls. Okay. And it looks like cartoonish graphics, which is not bad, but it's not 1995 graphics. We're good. Hey, neat. I heard about neat. That's actually a decent game. All right, let's see. Um, Posters in the room explain the basic controls. I've talked to people, press E. So who are you supposed to interact with in here? Oh, is that their own trailer? All right. <clears throat> um, take off your clothes by looking down. What? I don't think that is... Um, what? It says, take off your clothes by looking down and clicking the little white notch. Uh, one notch removes your shirt, the other removes your shoes, and if you don't have shoes, you have your pants. That doesn't really appeal to me after all. I mean, it looks pretty cool, but reading that, not so much. Uh, oh yeah, Chum Bucket. If anybody knows anything about Chum Bucket, that's pretty much, uh, if, uh, 
SpongeBob um, had Five Nights at Freddy's. It's just their equivalent of it. Pretty damn popular. I think he has a couple of them called Chum Bucket, but this one's 6 a.m. at Chum Bucket, not just Chum Bucket. Alright, um... The glass staircase, okay. <clears throat> hey, there's the doll game again. Nemesis, alright. Shiver, got it. Uh, Project Blood Crystal. Good name, strong, alright. Hey, see, this is how you know that developers, when they first send out a game, they did it through here. Bendy and the Ink Machine. Like they, they literally sent this. I think this is the old, old one. I'm not sure if it's the newest uh, version of the demo or not. But that would bring back a lot of memory. Like, I played that game back way before they did the changes um, in the beta and the uh, beta and the alpha, where it, it was nowhere near what it looked like now. It was completely different. <laughs> um, that would bring back a lot of mirrors if I downloaded that. I hope that's not the new one, though. Lisa heard that one before. Otherworld. Okay. Um. Ba da ba ba. Ba da bum bum bum. Ba da bum bum. Dun 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 dun. Oh, there's there's quite a bit of games to. Oh wait, what is this? What is it? Go back. Oh, dang it. I hate it when they don't have no screenshots to tell you what it's about, or at least show you like an example of what it's about. Painted red. That that reminds me a lot of uh, uh, Jack is Missing game, where you're just in a room and all that other crap. Huh, let's take a look. Yeah, the bathroom has, yeah, that, and the shower, and let's see, the, the room with the window, but the window's blocked in this in this one. Yeah, it looks a lot like Jack is missing. Not gonna lie, it's just a completely white room instead of it being detailed and um, j you know, j it does have a little. It looks like it has a lot better graphics, but yeah, Jack is missing does not have good graphics at all. But that doesn't bother me. But just telling you guys for preference, anything that I reference, you guys can go look up. It's all on you. <laughs> uh, don't know isolation or insulation. Sorry. Okay, so it brought me all the way back to the top after all that scrolling down. Screw it. I'm going to, let's see what they have for action. Not much difference. Okay. Um. <laughs> wait, what? Android and iOS. Big fat neighbor. Don't look back. Wait, what? Can I download these on my iPad? Um, let me go ahead and genre. Here we go. Um, all right, let's go go with shooter. All right, uh. No players online. <laughs> That's pretty much half the time. Hello, viewer. How you doing? Whoever you are, uh, if you're Pupix, pup, Pupix, uh, gaming, Pupix gaming, P U P A X. Hopefully, I'm saying that right. I'm so sorry if I'm not. I don't know if that's you, Balu. Why does this look like <laughs> Doom back? Uh, well doom but it's not doom oh oh yeah couldn't show no screenshots of this huh okay uh it just plays just like doom except every frame is a random dot atmosphere i don't think anybody would really want to play that to get epilepsy all right uh the escape okay cool Hey, Rubber Ducky, Mr. Tubby, 
<laughs> out liver. That looks like you're playing as an, a green army man. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, um. Last man kicking. Okay. All right. I don't really see much in, of interesting stuff here. Um, I mean, I see stuff that I would play that I'm interested in, but really nothing to showcase, to be honest. Uh, filth, filth breed. Copycats phenomenon. <laughs> That's, I don't know what that's supposed to be copying. If it's a copycat and it's just a pun in the game, but in the name. Uh -huh. All right. But yeah, this is where you definitely would come to Cuphead Brothers in Arms fan game. Uh -huh. Yeah, definitely. Uh, if you guys get a chance, uh, this is where you would check out games if you're a creator. Um, you like to play games. You want to get your name out there a lot faster. Uh, not saying it's going to be guaranteed, but it is one general good way to do it is to go to websites like Itchy website here. Um, download games that people upload uh, to get their name heard and if they get popular usually what happens is they they uh, bring it to or I think Steam catches on radar or whatever and and then uh, eventually helps them out but that's their part not your part but it does help uh, in the long run for people to search for stuff on YouTube and if you happen to have this game played on your channel chances your channel being uh, played are great and I just realized Cuphead Brothers here has Bindi, uh, Hello Neighbor, Cuphead himself, and I don't know who this guy is. But that's a pretty interesting mashup. That's, let me click on that. No, give me screenshots. Give me screenshots. Son of a... I knew you were going to do that. All right. Okay. Well... Ain't that a son of a bitch? But yeah, you can also pay for games as well here. Um, you know, uh, you don't really have to. There's a lot of games that are free. Um, I'm not sure what the paid ones are. Let's see. It looks like semi-known games. Not too shabby. But also keep in mind, just like how the regular games are on steam if you're an xbox person on xbox um that the more you pay towards the developer the more they are encouraged to do the hard work to fix the game that you like playing eventually not saying that's in all cases but eventually all right and super hot's in here too huh uh, i guess uh some uh some that they some of them just uh, start out wherever. That's pretty cool. Because I found Benny and the machine in here as well. Earlier. Okay, so enough of that. Um, Alright, I'm going to find another game to play. Because I'm at home, technically. So the title entails that. What should I play? Hmm. Right now I have Laser Fear, Subnautica, Hello Neighbor, the Alpha 3 version. Um, the Stanley Parable. Duck Season PC, The Observer. I already played the PT game. Um, and then Astro Near. Huh, what to play? What to play? Hmm. Hmm. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, why not? Let's go with Subnautica. Drag that right over here. Put that back at the top. There we go. All right. Time to play some Subnautica. If it starts. It should start. I haven't played this game in a while. I don't even know if my games are saved on here or not. Nope. Eh, of course not. The update just takes away all your games half the time. 
but I, in fairness, I did remove it completely and then put it on a different hard drive on my computer. I wasn't realizing it was doing it on the solid state. Uh, let's do regular survival. That's all we can do. I don't even know if I can change my title or anything. Oh no, press any button to start. All right. in the face all right oh Lori how you doing oh hell oh hell breaking loose oh shit come on gimme give gimme give what okay okay I'm picking it up I'm picking it up all right come on I right. put this shit out catch myself on fire all right everything just goes to fucking shit <laughs> okay pick my my tablet up you doing okay lori what 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 this pda you tell me minor head trauma this is considered an optimal outcome this pda has now rebooted in emergency mode with one directive to keep you alive on an alien world. Please refer to the data bank for detailed survival advice. Good luck. Thank you. And now I know why uh, they wanted that wanted to speak in British terms or rot. So anything in storage I need? Da -da 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 -da. Nope. Okay. No, nope, I didn't want that. Take that back. Okay. So let's go see what the damage is. Nice animation. Oh, it's beautiful and, and sad at the same time. Water. The Aurora suffered orbital hull failure. Cause unknown. Zero human life signs detected. Okay. All right. I think I need to go into survival mode and grab a bunch of stuff. Let's see. Grab some of those. Maybe I can eat them. I don't know. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I need to catch some fish. So let me go grab you. Aha. Oh crap. Oh crap. New creature discovered. New creature discovered. I'm so good at catching things. Let me tell you. Crap. Oxygen. 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 Go up. Go up. Go up. I don't. I, Okay, there it is. Okay. So I need more of these guys. Okay, got you. And I need you because you are really fast. All right. Come on. Oh, shh. Dang it. Uh-oh. All right. All right. Cool. Copper. Copper. It's an essential component of all powered equipment. Your probability of survival has just increased to unlikely, but plausible. Plausible, huh? 
All right. Shoot. Go up. Go up. Go up. Oxygen. Come on. All right. So I got some food. I need to figure out how to get water. What is that sound? Oh my gosh. All right. All right. So I need a. Uh, Cook, I guess. The fabricator cooks small organisms while disposing of the skeletal structure, bodily fluids, and internal organs, thus rendering them safe for human consumption. It is common for those accustomed to synthetic foods to be repulsed by eating an animal carcass. Remember that humans survived this way for millennia. You can too. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna make a battery. I think I'm gonna need that for what is it? Repair tool. I need sulfur, titanium, and rubber, 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 silicone. Okay, how do I make that again? Basic materials, rubber, silicone. Ah, uh, okay, I remember where to get that at now. Okay, so I'm gonna go for that, but let's see, I'm gonna put what I can in here. I don't need the extinguisher anymore. I'll battery in safekeeping, copper in safekeeping, and then I got all nothing but the food. Okay. So, consume, consume. Okay. All right. Can I go back out? Thank you. All right. Lori Butler. Oh, come on. I was just on your ass a second ago. Dang it. Dang it. It was just right there, too. It's this close and catching. This close. Sorry, I'm used to my camera being over here. <sighs> oh, titanium. I, I'll take that. Thank you. And I'm going to take a bunch of these. Okay. All right. And uh, let's see. That's for... Silicon rubber, that's right. Oxygen. Yes, yes, mate. I know. I'm going, I'm going. I'm getting all the air I need, man. Alright, so I need this. I don't know how many I need. Let's see. Uh, let's see. Okay, so I got the rubber. I need sulfur and titanium. Titanium. All right, and sulfur. Okay. All right, so I'm gonna put my stuff in here for safekeeping. I should probably make uh, some lube and then some more rubber just to be on the safe side. That takes up a lot of room. Are these rotted? Nope. Old, uh, okay. Oh. Yeah, those are gonna. Okay, so, uh, those are gonna. Those are gonna rot on me, anyways, later, so I don't really care. Alright. I need to make one more of these and then some more. Or is some lube just in case I need that later? Because. Is essential in construction of vehicles and power plants. Right, you are. Oh, okay, I can make a lot of this crap, apparently. Okay, I'll make some fins. The fabricator draws from available data to provide environment appropriate equipment using locally available materials. For your safety, this setting cannot be overridden. Okay, and I need to go uh, I think sulfur is in those little caves with those little monster guys. Hey, I can swim a lot better. That's pretty cool. All right, some more titanium just in case. Let me swim up here real quick. Gas. But, uh... All right. Where... Okay, so where are... Okay, their caves are over here. Not the caves, but the, the little grounds that you would go on. Um... All right. I know there's a little, little 
exploding fish somewhere around here somewhere. Usually is. Oh, hey, give me, give me that. I see they were bugging in my ear earlier, like they were gonna come out and shoot at me, but now they're not. N now they're not gonna tell me where they're at. Okay. Oh uh, crap. Oh uh, crap. What is that? What is that? Am I getting shot at? No. The game would not dare. Okay. So, I don't have a cave to go in, or is that a cave? Yep, that's a cave. Cool. Uh, I need some of this anyway. Uh-oh, it's getting dark. Okay, so I, there's nothing in that one. Crap. Alright. <laughs> okay, one more time, one more time. Let me see. Let me go into this direction. I don't have a bed, so I can't exactly go to sleep real quick in the game. There's some crystal. This looks like a spot for a... Oh, no, it's not. I was going to be wrong either way. Ah, crap. Ooh, that was close. Okay, so you were right here. All right, I got a repair tool now. Yay. All right, so time to go get... Crap, crap, crap. All right. It's underneath me the entire time. That's pretty awesome. Okay, so over here, sorry. Um, I need to grab, uh, let's see, da, 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 da. I need to grab that, grab that. What was it, what was it, is that it? Is that all of it? Maybe one more, okay, okay. I need a tool and then bam. Let's fix this bad boy. I knew that wasn't all of it. Let me see. Battery. And it just magically puts itself back together. Life pod secondary systems online. Running full environment diagnostic and outputting results to data bank. Cool. Okay. That, that, I guess that's how long it's gonna take me to get rescued. Strange. Oh yeah, I forgot about the med kits. Those might come in handy too. I just put those in here. Da, da, da. Da, 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 da. All right. So, actually, I need. To, I'm gonna grab one of those, one of those, and. Oh, I got the battery. Never mind. <clears throat> okay. Let's see what else I can make real quick. Cause I need tools. I don't know what tools I need, but I need tools. Let's see. Um. More oxygen tank, fire extinguisher, pipes. Okay, no. Scanner. That might come in handy. The scanner can be used to synthesize blueprints from salvage technology and to record alien biological data. New blueprint acquired. Cool. Weapons were removed from standard survival blueprints following the massacre on Abraxas Prime. The knife remains the only exception. Uh, weird, but okay. 
Secondary systems online, uh, outgoing radio communication offline, uh, incoming radio communication online. Flotation device deployed, uh, hull integrity okay. Um, uncharted ocean planet, 4546B. Okay, so I guess that's where I'm at. 4546B uh, is where I'm located. Cool beans. That is awesome. Again, I'm used to my camera being over here. Sorry. Uh, 17%. Okay, so I need to get... Um, crap. Uh, water. I think I'm, I, that's like my next thing. So I think there's like fish for that. I gotta go find them. So that's where the ship is at. I think... The bladder fish. New creature discovered. Bladder fish, bladder fish, come Alien here. Life forms may have unexpected applications. Utilizing alien resources is a proven survival strategy. Is it now? Because I didn't know that. Uh, I'm glad bladder fish can be seen at nighttime a little bit easier. I don't know how true that is, but apparently you, you can spot them really quick. It's pretty nice. Okay, well I got enough uh enough water, and I'll take a snack if it lets me. Damn it! Damn it! There we go. Boomerang bullshit. Ooh, another bladderfish. Come here. Mine. Mine. I'm gonna have water for days. Alright. Come here. Eh, come here. One more. One more. Alright. Okay, I'm done. I mean, I want to go pick them all, but I'm, d I'm done. For now. And let's see. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and make all the water I can real quick. Because that's gonna be highly important. I think I need to and I think I need to go get some titanium and make a storage box. Uh How do I do that? Wait, tools. I need um detecting uh, increased local radiation levels. Trend is consistent with damage to the Aurora's drive core sustained uh -oh. during planet fall. Crap. Okay. Uh computer chip wiring kit and battery that's why I need to make the habitat builder and then I can make some storage boxes and extra habitats okay the computer chip is going to be table coil gold copper wire and of course copper wiring kit is going to be silver ore crap uh it's going to all right, you know what? We're just gonna stick with what we got. Okay, I'm gonna do water, and I don't know if I should cook the food yet for the fish. I don't know if the fish will die or if it gets spoiled if I try to cook it. But at least I'll have some water. I got a lot of a lot of water apparently. <laughs> oh, interesting, interesting, my dude. Yes, let's cook the boomerang. Okay, and... Okay, um, tasted great. Got some, uh, some pointers for you. Switch, switch, switch. All right, so I need Copper, don't have, that's old, decomposing, okay. So, these I can drop, I don't, oh, I do got some gold, okay. Um, I need gold, silver ore. Okay, I need to drop those. I need... Okay, so I need some table ore here. Okay, that's weird. Didn't let me 
grab it as soon as I. And then I gotta go grab it. Okay. Cool. Alright. I got enough of those for days. Um. Yeah, I got a lot. Okay. Maybe I can drop a few. Okay. Don't need that many. I need silver ore. Which I gotta go exploring to look for now. I need gold. Um, that's another one. Copper for sure. Is that something I can... Nope. Okay. It's not gonna be easy trying to spot all these things. Son of a... Crap, I didn't even realize it was that low. LOL, LOL, what's going on? How you doing? Welcome to the channel. The Game Eater's at it again. We are playing Subnautica. And probably gonna die in the next 20 minutes. <laughs> oh, hey, look at that. Um, nothing in there. So how, how's everybody doing? I need a scanner. Do I have a scanner? I do got a scanner. Okay, go back. There we go. Cool. Wait, what's this? Counter. Why do I want a counter? I don't want a counter. Okay. What is that? A, oh yeah, grab trap. That actually comes in handy more than not, to be honest. Okay, titanium, which I did not need. I can get all the scraps around here for titanium if I need need it that badly. What I need is silver ore and gold. Silver ore and gold. Sorry. <laughs> I gotta remember these things. Okay. Ah, crap. Well, that that worked out pretty well, I guess. <laughs> it glitched out. Titanium again. I don't need titanium, son of a biza. All right. Uh, I know there's like a big giant core core around here somewhere. Where's my little? All right, so I think I, I think I gotta go closer towards the ship. Um, yeah, there's like a big uh, coral like this, but one you can actually get into. And it has um, sand thing, um, things that you can break in order to get. Oh, copper, perfect. I need more, but that's perfect. I'll take what I can get. Okay, so where is the ship at? Okay, scan that, fine. <clears throat> and the more stuff you scan, which I like about this game, is the more um, you can see it come up if you have the scanner room, which that's that's exactly what I really want to get. How is it that every time I go away from... Oh, that's right. Okay. Yeah, I'm so used to this being behind me, not in front of me. So how close can I get before radiation starts hitting in? That's the real question. All right, so there's supposed to be a core. Oh, there it is. I think that's not not very big, but that's one of them. That's not even. Yeah, that's not one at all. Okay. So my little things over there, the little ships over here. So I need to go this direction. I really need to find some survival stuff. Oh. All right. Uh. I want, um, Northland down here, mate. Okay. Nope, nope, nope. Got cool. to give up for some air. Alright, so I'm pretty decently close to it. And I'm not getting a radiation sound off yet. So hopefully, I can do this. Um, crap. Damn it. What the frick? Okay. I'll just, 
take that. Alright, there's that one, but where'd the other one come from? Oh. What is that? A shutter bug, okay. What do you do, buddy? Nothing? Okay. Right, let me get some air. Oh. Titanium. I don't need quartz right now. What I do need is more copper. Okay, uh, I'm good with copper. I need gold and uh, silver ore. My crap. No, 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 no. Stay away. Son of a beach. Damn it. Thirty seconds. Really. I got 30 seconds of air, can't go back for that right now. I got less than 15 seconds of air, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Yeah. Oxygen. Yeah, yeah, I made it. Okay. Alright, so there's gotta be a big coral around here somewhere. Alright, so there's the ship, there's that. I gotta go this... Probably gotta go a little more this direction, I don't know. I know there's a big coral that you go towards and it has like a bunch of uh, silver ore and stuff like that in it. That's what I need. Yeah, let me pick up some of this titanium real quick. Okay. And then, no, nope. I don't know where I'm going. Am I getting too close to the Leviathan? Oh, I'm getting way too close to the Leviathan. But there's a sand shark just now. All right, getting a little too close for comfort in this area. On this planet grows in unusually distinct and diverse ecological biomes. Does it? Further study recommended. Yeah. Well, you by all means jump out of your computer and uh, go look for me, will you? I get a feeling you're telling me to go search and do research on this crap, and I don't want to. Especially if I'm a lone survivor right now. Dang it. I really wish I knew where, where this stuff was at. Okay. Um, is that something? Nope. Hey, more bladder fish. Let me grab you real quick. Okay. Grabbed it. Now I need some more. New creature discovered. Hey, hoverfish. And yet it's underwater. How much of a hovering are you doing? Not living up to your name potential, buddy. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh, crap. <laughs> no. No, thank you. All me have is a knife. Not much to defend myself. Yeah, got it. All right. And there are the pooper booties. Stop taking a crap everywhere. Oh, my gosh. What did I ever do to you? Polluting. You're just polluting. That's all you're doing, man. What if I can knock one of those out? That'd be pretty awesome. Hey. Hey. There's nothing in here. 
All right, so I don't know where those uh, giant corals are at. That's that's pretty strange. Like I could have sworn I covered all the ground that I remember them being at. So it must be that that they moved it in an update of some sorts. I don't know. But the coil was just one giant coil, and you can go in there and it had the um, uh, sand uh, stones where you break them open for silver ore gold and all that fun jazz which made it a little easier to make some things uh where am i going is this okay so i'm going a little bit more in depth into and closer towards the aurora All right, I'm going deep. I'm going deep. I'm going deep. I'm going deep, and I'm gonna swim hard. And I'm gonna swim hard. And I'm gonna swim hard. Hey, look, some oxar John. All right, what is this? Cinnamon, really? Well, at least I'm gonna have uh, enough sulfur to last me for days. Okay. All right. Detecting sulfur deposits <sighs> the cave I should have brought a med pack. Oh, I died. I am the worst player in the world. Do I still have my stuff? No, I don't have any of it. Shit. I don't even know where I died at. Oh, well. Okay. Well, hell. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to end the stream. Stay tuned later on sometime in the next following weeks for my giveaways. Uh, I am almost at 5,000. Uh, I'll do a small giveaway on that, but I am reaching for 10,000 for a bigger giveaway. But more details later. You guys have a great night and see you later.